Strapi is a free and open source content management system. Let's set up the product in your AWS account. You can find the link for the developer guide under the additional resources section of the product page. If you have fulfilled all the prerequisites, you can continue to set up the product. To begin with, click the continue to subscribe button. After subscribing, you will need to accept the terms and conditions. Click on accept terms to proceed. Please wait for a few minutes while the processing takes place. Once it's completed, click on continue to configuration. Select the CloudFormation template as the fulfillment option. Choose the version and your preferred region. Afterward, click the Continue to Launch button from the Choose Action drop-down menu and launch this software page. Select Launch CloudFormation and click Launch button. Now we can create CloudFormation stack. Ensure the template is ready radio button is selected under Prepare Template. Click Next. Provide a unique stack name. Provide the admin email for SSL generation. For deployment name, enter a name of your choice. Provide a public domain name for domain name. Strapi will automatically try to set up SSL based on provided domain name if that domain is hosted on Route 53. Please make sure your domain name is hosted on Route 53. Choose an instance type. Recommended is T3.small. Select your preferred key name. Select the S3 bucket to store backups. Set SSH location as 0.0.0.0 slash 0. Keep subnet CIDR block as 10.0.0.0 slash 24. Keep VPC CIDR block as 10.0.0.0 slash 16. Click Next. Now we can configure stack options. Click Next. Review and verify the details you've entered. Tick the box that says, I acknowledge that a WS CloudFormation might create IAM resources with custom names. Click Submit. Afterward, you'll be directed to the CloudFormation Stacks page. Please wait for 5 to 10 minutes until the stack has been successfully created. Fast forwarding 5 to 10 minutes. After CloudFormation is created, we can update DNS. Copy the public IP labeled public IP in the Outputs tab. Go to a WS Route 53 and navigate to Hosted Zones. Select the correct Hosted Zone. From there, click on Create Record and enter the domain name. Paste the copied public IP address into the value text box and click Create Record. Now you can access the Strapi application through the dashboard URL provided in the Outputs tab. Let's see how to generate SSL manually. Open the terminal and go to the directory where your private key is located. Paste the following command into your terminal and press enter. SSH-I Yorkie name Ubuntu at public IP address. Type yes and press enter. This will log you into the server. Paste the following command into your terminal and press enter and follow the instructions. You can also find the command under the Generate SSL section of the guide. sudo-root-certificate-generate-standalone.sh Admin email is needed to generate SSL certificates. In our example, SSL certificate is already installed. Now you can access the Strapi dashboard. Enter the admin details. Create a strong password. Then click on Let's Start button. Now you can log into the admin dashboard. Close the tab and try to log in again. You can enter the previously entered details and log into the admin dashboard. Enjoy Strappy!